Hi everyone, this is Dr. Brian from Genesis Chiropractic Software, which is a product of Billing Precision LLC. Uh, what we're going to review today is the point of sale, the new point of sale with inventory management and the new option to use barcodes. So let me bring you to that screen. So the way you can actually configure your system to um, uh, be able to use barcodes and manage your inventory is this. Uh, you go to the Configuration tab, Practice, and Point of Sale. And you'll see there's in this practice there's a whole bunch of different items with different CH codes, the price, the tax, the dis short and long description. Uh, what is new is what's right here. The barcode, the items left, and the threshold, and I'll explain what, you, what each one of those is. The barcode, um, what you do is you, just, you simply click on this field and you take whatever product you have that has a barcode on it, or you can give your own barcodes and, and stick labels on them. But you take the barcode and you take the scanner and you scan it. And when, when this, what the scanner does is actually translates that barcode into uh, either numbers or letters of numbers. Um, and that gets translated in, and then it hits the Enter key for you automatically. Uh, the items left is simply, once you start using barcodes, how many items you have left. This is part of the inventory management piece. So let's say you have um, seven of these left. And the threshold is what, when you want your team to reorder. So if you have seven now, but if you go below three, you want your team to reorder them, you simply just put the threshold in. Now what happens is if your inventory ever goes below three, the system will open a ticket and send it to your workbench for your team to reorder the product. So we're actually using our, um, our workflow management system right here. And, and again, the three categories for our workflow system, patient flow or patient retention, cash flow, and compliance. So this would obviously go under the cash flow uh, category. So that's it. Once you enter those three fields, you'll go and you'll hit the Save button up here. You hit the Save button right there. And you can see we've updated that item. Uh, next, what, the way you'd actually use this with a patient is from the schedule, you'd bring up, I brought up a test patient here, and I go to the More tab, Point of Sale, and I select the field and scan the code. So once you use that scanner, as soon as you scan that barcode, it automatically hits Enter for you um, and updates the field with the charges and everything. So the next thing is you, if you wanted to have more than one unit, you can either manually update the units or scan it again. If you scan it again, it automatically updates the unit, number of units for you. And then you would just simply follow your normal checkout procedure.